What's going on guys? My name is Ted and Tim bringing you some more zombies gameplay. Uh, everyone loves zombies, at least I do, so hopefully you'll enjoy watching it. I get to a pretty high round here with one of my friends named Krangled, and um, we had a kind of a bullshit death, but I'll explain that more at the end. So anyways, um, I wanted to post some new content on my channel. I wanted to you know, kind of steer away from 100% Call of Duty and maybe integrate some more different video games or different computer games, things like that. Um, but I'm debating whether or not to start a whole new channel for it or whether to just dive in and throw it in on this channel too. So here's the thing. I know that I've got almost a thousand subscribers now and I know that the majority of people are going to only want to see Call of Duty because for whatever reason it's the most popular game and you know you don't want to see anything else, you don't want to see a, a channel diversify. I understand that. But I need your help in that what do you want me to start posting more of and if you want to see a different game should I start it on a new channel or should I just integrate it into this channel. Um, I don't think it's a problem for someone to subscribe to two channels. Um, you know, It's going to be the same number of videos, just a different channel is going to be posting them. So if you want to, if I get the community that says, you know, hey, I want to start a new channel for these new for these different games, let me know and I'll start a new channel for them. And um, in the next couple of videos, I'll probably leave a link to the new channel so you can go over there and subscribe. If not, you just want me to put the gameplays on here, let me know on that too. And I can just post all of the gameplay content on this channel. But the games that I want to start doing, I've got Battlefield 3. And um, I want to start posting some Battlefield content because I know that it's, it's a less popular game, but it's still a very COD-esque. It's, it's very similar in its ways. You know, other people will argue that's completely different. It's still a first-person shooter. you got guns involved. So I want to post that up too. But the other thing I want to post, and I might start a whole new channel for this because I know it's a totally different game, is RuneScape. Um, I've got almost 300 days of RuneScape played. I, I played it all through 6th grade, and I quit up about 10th grade. I'm in 12th grade now, so I haven't really, I haven't, I've played it on and off, I guess, for the last couple of years. Never more than once a week, though, and honestly, not even that much. I haven't been on for more than a month. But here's the thing. Um, for any of you RuneScapers out there that, <laughs> that really enjoy the game, um, if, you're, if you have a life, just turn off your ears because this is total nerd talk. Um, I'm level 134 combat. And I really enjoy the game. So even though I haven't played in a long time, and I'm sure I'm out of date on you know all the new weapons and things like that, I'm level 134 combat. I've got like 2,200 total levels, something like that, and almost 212 days of gameplay. That's almost twice as much as I have total on Call of Duty. So to put that stuff in perspective, I'm very good at the game. But here's the thing, um, and I'm going to give my name out in a bit. But I wanted to get rich. Well, I was rich. I had about 800 mil. So some will consider that rich. Some will consider that poor. It just depends on where your status is at. I had about 800, 900 mil. Back at the time when party hats were about 1.2 billion GP. Now they're worth like, you know, max cash. So I had basically half where I've owned party hats before. I've owned a green and a red back when they were only about 150 mil um, on the grand exchange. But I risked it all in a duel against a guy that was many levels lower than me, fully expecting a victory. But the problem is he had glitches, and somehow he healed himself halfway through the duel, which when healing was off and all that food stuff was off, I made sure of that. Um, but somehow or another, he glitched and healed himself. I think it was a dungeoneering glitch, so something going on about that. This is right when dueling got reintroduced, and I lost all my money, and I quit. So I was rich, and now I'm poor. But the thing is, is that when I start playing again to bring out you know, PK videos or maybe um, you know, bank videos or just merching videos, all kinds of stuff I can throw up on my channel. I'm going to need money. So if you want to be my friend, um, I'm going to add everyone, but it, it would be greatly appreciated if you'd also donate some money for me. Um, I need money to start making money, and I can make money incredibly quickly in that game. I just have literally nothing. Like I maybe got like 20, 30K on that account right now. Um, I'm an avid staker. I'm an avid PKer. I enjoy all that stuff, and I was actually decently good at it. So if you want to add me on my friends list, um, my name is Always Rich. I'll leave, a, I'll leave it down in the description, but it's kind of ironic now that I'm completely broke off my ass, but at the time I was very wealthy um, when I made that username, and uh, like I said, I'll leave the name down in the description below, add me if you want to, um, message me on here first though, so, I'm, so I know to add you back, because obviously, or you can just message me on there, I don't get on too often, but um, if I know, if, if enough of y'all come to me saying you've added me, then I'll get on there, um, if none of y'all message me, then I'm never going to get on there, but if you add me, or if you want to add me, make sure you message my YouTube account first with your username, that way I know that you're actually wanting to add me, that'd be fantastic. Also, like I said, any donations are gladly accepted, and they're going to go toward content that I'm going to put out on this channel. So any like money that you can give me will go toward you know PK videos, staking videos, things like that would be awesome. And I'd love if, um, you know, any help that I can get from you guys. Um, I know people that play Call of Duty sometimes always play RuneScape too. Not always, but I think everyone's played the game at least once in their life. So anyways, that's the update. Um, once again, whether I should start a new channel or not, I'm not sure about. I want your info on that. Leave that down below. 
Other than that, guys, the gameplay ended because, for some reason, the teleporter went and teleported, which really pissed me off. Um, we had a great start to this game, and we were going to get really far, but unfortunately, the teleporter decided not to teleport us when we were holding X, and I made a last-minute ditch, um, and I tried to get out of it, but I didn't have Juggernaut, so. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. Post high-quality content every single day. Once again, new stuff coming up. Always uh, diversify my channel to what you guys want, and I'll uh, catch you later. Bye.